Hi, Cliff Wadman here with About.com Food. Gummy bears. Everyone loves them. But what everyone doesn't know is how easy and fun they are to make at home. This is the perfect project on a rainy day for the kids, and the end result is just as good as anything you'd buy in the store. Let's check it out. For this recipe, we'll need a couple of candy molds, and you can get these at any local arts and crafts store. We're going to need one third cup of water, a three ounce package of flavored gelatin, and two one quarter ounce packets of non-flavored gelatin. In a small saucepan, we're going to pour one third cup of water in, and then we're going to slowly add the regular gelatin and let that absorb a little bit. And then we'll go ahead and add the flavored gelatin as well. Now you wanna let this sit on the counter for about 10 minutes so the water works its way through the gelatin. After that 10 minutes is up, we want to put the saucepan onto medium heat for about three to four minutes and you just want to stir the gelatin until it's completely dissolved. Once this mixture is completely liquid, we're going to take it off the heat and we want to pour it into a glass measuring cup. And then you're going to take your candy molds and you just want to go ahead and pour the right amount of gelatin into each of the molds. Once you have those set, you want to leave those on the counter for a couple minutes and then you'll want to put them into the freezer for about 10 to 15 minutes. Now the gummy should be pretty firm, so we'll take them out of the freezer after that 15 minutes. And the last step, which is optional, is to take some cornstarch and coat the backs so they won't stick together. So I'm going to apply some cornstarch here, and then I'm going to just use my hand to wipe off the excess. And then we can go ahead and peel the gummies out of the molds. And once you're done, they're ready to eat. This is a really fun recipe for kids. They taste great. Try a variety of flavors. Try out some different molds as well. I hope you enjoyed the recipe and you get a chance to try it out soon. For more videos, check out about.com.